Audrey. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hits one! Pepper did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. It is pretty close to an ideal evening for football. There is a barely a cloud evident. The world and his wife have gone to great lengths to be here for a match of great consequence and massive interest in these parts. Barely a breath of wind, so the football has no excuses for not being at its very best. The teams I know are pumped for this. They are fantastic scenes in the stands. There is a great sense of drama here, a great sense of their excitement and expectation. Unmistakably, this is the Camp Nou, staging a game in the way only the Camp Nou can. Two high-profile, high-caliber teams. This is a welcome event for all these supporters. Yes, Peter, it's a shame it's only a, a friendly, but then again, that may help us see a more expressive attacking contest. And I'd be prepared to settle for a, a clash of, of lesser intensity in favor of, of lots of flair, skill, and plenty of tricks, and a few goals. I suspect I've probably overstretched my, my level of greed here. So it's down to business here. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? I don't think we've seen a dribbler as good as this guy, Vinicius Jr., in some time. His, his favourite move is to receive the ball in a wide position, attract defenders his way, where he can turn them and just leave them behind um, and have a clean run at goal. He's a very tricky customer and getting better week by week. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. He's off on a marauding run. Uh, it's a mistimed tackle, and it is a penalty. Manchester City really could have done without this. Well, it's always worrying that the psyche is affected after a, a missed penalty. Rodri. Foden. He's made good progress from a deep position. Foden. Valverde plays it forward. He's through. Hossalu. Hossalu! Hossalu! Oh, that's a terrific save from the keeper. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Kamavinga. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Well, Peter, look how far up the fullbacks are getting now. This is really high. And constantly after the ball, aren't they? Yeah, I think they're, they're weighing up their options to see how long they can sustain this and, and suppress those wide opposition players. Bellingham drives it forward. Carvajal looking to get on the end of this. Ake. Bernardo Silva. City still to register a shot on target. Rodri. Valverde. Nacho. Camavinga. Tony Kroos. Camavinga. Forward it goes. Hossalu. Valverde. Oh, 
no, that's not the ball he wanted. A buccaneering run from the defender. Real Madrid have themselves a corner, I think. Yes, they do. Look at the goal! Good idea, just poorly executed. Done very well to intervene. Bernardo Silva. Doku. Rodri. Tries to get it forward quickly. Hits one! Did well the first time, nothing he could do about the follow-up. That's just top-notch, showed exactly why he follows it up every time. Keeper struggles to hold on to it, ball breaks kindly, he's always about. Sky Blues take the lead, 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Needs a bit of penetration to go with all this possession. Hoists it forward. Hosselu, it's Hosselu! Good stop, that wasn't easy. Hosselu sparked a tremendous stop there, and I think it's fair to add, he just wasn't expecting it. Kamavinga. I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Kyle Walker. Time whistle goes. And there we are. Off they go for half time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. And that has only been.